The Pirate offense showed plenty of promise last year, and now they expect an even bigger season in 2020. The Pirate football team hopes to get back to work tomorrow. As we stand right now, the season still kicks off September the 12th at home against the Thundering Herd of Marshall. Tonight, we begin our official Station of the Pirates previews with a look at the high-powered East Carolina offense, and that offense is led by former D.H. Conley star Holton Aylers. Yeah, I mean, I think, you know, this whole offense really, this is our first offseason with the same offense as the previous year, and I think it's showing a lot. I mean, we got we got a lot of good leaders on offense that are leading by example. I mean, I think, the, you know, the, we're returning, I think, like 87% of our um, stats from last year. So, I mean, the guys the guys are there. I mean, the playbook's there. We're just excited to go out there and produce. We got we got great we got great talent all across the board. You got Demetrius Mooney, you got Darius Penix, Holden Aylers, Blake Prohl. You got a nice backup, Adiyah Matosho. You got Andre Pegues, Tyler Sneed, Josiah Hatfield. All of them, like we're all athletes. We're gonna be in the best in the nation, whether it's running the ball, throwing the ball, um, whether it's holding, just you know, trucking people, running around people. I saw him working over the on the speed over break. But uh, now I'm excited. I'll be excited, yes, sir. Coach Houston always had been a uh, run first offense. That's why before, previously, when he was at JMU, he recruited me a lot. And I mean, I was, I was a downhill runner, which is what he likes. And I mean, he's, he's said that he was going to bring a lot of the run game. He was going to run first and then open it up, start passing. So when I came here, I you know, I kind of set a goal to, to bring ECU's program back. And, you know, I talked to those guys that were a little bit younger than me that, um, you know, we can do this together and we can bring, you know, this community kind of back with it. And, um, you know, hopefully by the time we're done with this place, that's what it is.